Police are tonight trying to figure out who burglarized two tombs at Beaumont's Forest Lawn Cemetery. And it didn't stop there. A casket was pulled open. 12 News reporter Jordan James joins us now with the latest on the search for those who did this. The graveyard. It's the place where folks go to say their final goodbyes. Now Beaumont police needs your help figuring out who has awakened the dead. It really hurt me. It hurt me to hear that. Dwight Benoit has been pastor at Magnolia Missionary Baptist Church for more than 20 years. Nothing happens in his community without him knowing about it. This neighborhood is um, our mission and our ministry. Haven't been here 24 years. Out of all those years, this was the first time he's heard of anything like this. Down the street from his church at Forest Lawn Cemetery, two tombs were damaged and a casket was removed from the mausoleum early this month. And to have that resting place be disturbed, um, it, it's a very uncomfortable and um, a disturbing feeling. It's not something that that anyone should take lightly. Beaumont police released an image of the crime scene with the hope that they can get new leads to follow. Well, family. The longtime pastor was disappointed to find out what happened in his neighborhood. To hear that young men, women, whoever um, committed the crime did that, they don't have to do such things. As a family is left grieving yet again, Burnett hopes that they can find hope in a senseless situation. They only desecrated a, a brick and mortar, um, a clay and ash burial ground, but their loved one is at peace with God. Beaumont Police is encouraging anyone with information to contact them or Crime Stoppers at 833-TIPS. Reporting here live in Beaumont, Jordan James, 12 News. Thank you, Jordan.